Mega Man 8-Bit Deathmatch. Playing Mega Man 3, Chapter 3, basically. Now we're on Top Man stage. This is one of the uh, redesigned levels for version 4, so if you've played this game before, this is going to be a little bit different. I'm actually, well, actually, I think they added this level in for uh, version 3B, possibly, so it could be that as well. But uh, either way, it's pretty different from the original release, so anyway, let's just go ahead and hop in here. Mr. Top Man. Now, Top Man's power is also pretty freaking amazing. If I can get a hold of it. Oh, we also have base. Base basically allows you to uh, fire a rapid fire buster. This is pretty damn awesome. Come on, crack ceiling, train asshole. Fuck you, charge man. Damn right. Oh, all right. Oh, so I found out what this item does. I don't think I ever announced it before, but uh, this basically allows you to. Uh, if you pick up ammo off the ground, then it'll just automatically go to one of your low item, uh, low weapon ammunition counts. Basically, when you pick up those little, uh, ammunition boxes, while you have that thing equipped, then instead of having to have the item, instead of having to go to each individual weapon to restore the ammo, it basically just does it for you. So you don't have to worry about switching around items in order to, uh, replenish all of your uh, ammunition. If that makes any sense at all, that might have been completely convoluted. But, I still haven't found Top Man's ability. I'd really like to have that. Oh, here it is. Okay, so, this thing. Let's see if I can pull this off. There we go. It kind of makes you dizzy, potentially, but if you do that right on top of someone, you're basically spinning around and doing like a super top spin kind of attack. You have to jump before you use it, though. That's not a trick. But yeah, you can pretty much insta-kill a lot of people. There we go, I just, like that, for example. Pretty damn powerful weapon. Good god. So is Wave Man's ability, apparently. There we go. Well, I took out some people. The trick with Wave Man's ability, you want to land as many of those waves on them as possible. Really maximize your damage output with that thing. I'll just take that, thank you very much. Oh, here's the Spark Shot, which is a pretty nice ability. It actually can freeze people when it hits them, or like holds them in place, basically. Which is actually kind of handy, especially if you're doing like team deathmatch and you have one guy using that while the other does attacks. Six. That's Top Man's stage, and that's Top Man's ability. Pretty damn awesome, if I do say so myself. Short and sweet. Anyway, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next level. Alright, later.